Question 5. Ammonium ions are formed when ammonia gas reacts with hydrogen chloride gas. Which statement about the change that occur in this reaction is correct? Okay, so for this question, first uh, you need to know the hybridization of the nitrogen in this ammonia. Okay, ammonia is has uh, three bonding pair, one lone pair. Okay, its hybridization is sp3. The three unpaired electrons here will used to form the three sigma bonds here with the hydrogen and the lone pair the lone pair here is also in the hybrid orbitals and this lone pair will be able to donate to the empty orbitals of the proton and form dative bond. After it's formed dative bond with the H plus, okay, so it will form this uh, ammonium which is tetrahedrogeometry. And the bond angle is now changed from 107 to 109.5 degree. Okay, but however you need to know after the dative bonds form, the hybridization of nitrogen still no change. Is still sp3 okay so let's start uh, the question the dipole moment of the ammonium is greater than the dipole moment of the ammonia molecule um, so the ammonium is actually a charged particle so a dipole moment uh, most likely uh, we refer to the uh, partial charge positive negative so this this comparison is not really that uh, that that correct right so uh, therefore a not the answer for b the h and h bond angle means this one okay decreased when ammonium ions form so the h and h bond is actually increased from 107 to 109.5 Therefore, this one also wrong. C. The hybridization of nitrogen does not change. Okay, so as, I told, as I told you just now, the hybridization before and after the dative bonds formation is still the same as between. So answer is C. Okay, so why D is not the answer? There is electron transfer from nitrogen to chlorine. Nope. So is uh, the dative bonds form is between the nitrogens and the, the hydrogens ion. Right. So therefore, answer is C. That's all. Thank you.